Hello everyone, thank you for taking a look at my video and my channel, and I was going to say welcome to Grand Union, which is the name of my island on Animal Crossing New Horizons, um, but we're not actually on my island today, we're here in my kitchen, and uh, for those of you that uh, haven't tuned into my channel before and might be just seeing this for the first time, uh, my name is Chuck, and I document um, basically my video playthrough of Animal Crossing New Horizons, and I've been playing since May of 2020, and uh, my first year was basically just kind of building my island and uh, not waterscaping or terraforming at all, and then last year I did minimal terraforming and waterscaping, um, and this year for 2022, um, I'm full-scale um, changing up the appearance of my island. Um, I didn't necessarily flatten my island. Um, I basically have just been working on it in sections, but um, all of the water has moved, and a lot of the terraforming throughout the island has also changed. So um, took a lot of... took a long time and a lot of work, but it's been fun and I've been kind of just sharing it as I as I go along. So um, if you guys are interested in seeing that, uh, feel free to go back to some of my older videos. If you like my content, uh, think about hitting the subscribe button and you'll see future playthroughs. Uh, but for today, we are going to be opening up some Animal Crossing Series 5 Amiibo cards, which I was lucky enough to get at Target. So I was able to get three packages and I wanted to share them with you guys. So, this is um, the Animal Crossing Series 5 Amiibo cards. And these are the NPC um, characters that you can get in um, your packets. So, in uh, America, they, you have a total of six cards that you get in your package. Um, one will be a specialty NPC card, which is um, one of these... Um, characters here on uh, the outside of the package here. Um, we have Tom Nook, Isabel, uh, Timmy and Tommy. We have from the Happy Home Paradise, Lottie, Wardell, and Nico. K.K. Slider. Flick, CJ, Label, Harv, Daisy May, Orville, and Wilbur. My mind went blank. I wanted to call him Walter for some reason. <laughs> Anyways, guys. Um, yeah, so I've never played Animal Crossing before, um, but with 2020, um, I definitely needed a stress relief and was watching a bunch of um, content creators um, playing Animal Crossing, and it looked like a really fun game, so I went out and bought a Switch um, when I was able to find one, and I got the game. And I've been playing ever since. Um, but I just basically recently at the end of 2020 um, started documenting. I got um, an NPC card and then I started collecting. Um, sorry, I got an Amiibo card um, as a gift. And I started um, collecting Amiibo cards. So I'm actually actively um, collecting packs of cards. I haven't opened any in a while, so... Um, but yeah, that's what's going on, guys. So let's open this up and take a look at what we got. All right. And I'm going to open these all up right now. And I was actually watching... A content creator um, named Alex Giovanni um, open up packs of Amiibo cards and he showed me a really cool trick because um, I always tried to like open it here from this little tear spot on the top um, but supposedly you can just open it from the back oh yeah take a look at that all right, guys. Let's let's do that again, because I see so many people like doing this, and they actually will tear it here at this little tear spot, like this. And yeah, this is all you get. Um, but I never actually thought about trying to um, 
That's probably not going to work now that I actually um, tore it open. So now you have to open it up all the way like this. And then, yeah, that is very easy. All right. All right, Alex, if you're watching this, Alexei, if you're watching this, um, <laughs> thank you very much for that tip because um, this is how I have always um, gone in and opened my cards. It's basically running my finger down the side and then you've got everything kind of falling out like this. And this is just so much neater and easier. Plus, if I have any duplicates, I can always slide them back into these packets. So this is the outside of the actual inside sleeve. That's kind of... I guess almost like a little aluminum plastic package. All right. All right, guys, here we go. We are starting with our very first pack of Series 5. Who do we have? Ah! All right, guys. We have number 445, which is Fret. Number 441, which is Chabwick. Cute little penguin. Ah, we have number 432, which is Renee. And I actually won a um, bingo tournament on this uh, card here, Renee. I was waiting for one bingo number, or one bingo villager to be called. And she was actually one of the choices for me to uh, win bingo, and I won bingo. So I was really excited about that. So 432 is Renee. And she was in the start of the game for Animal Crossing New Horizons. She was like one of the new eight villagers. Um, so it's really cool to kind of actually have her card. I've never had her on the island, but she might be kind of neat to have. I've never had a horse villager before. Oh, and we have number 434, which is Ione. Ione? And from what I understand, Ione glows in the... Um, glows in the dark at night, which would be kind of really fun to see. All right. Oh, gosh, guys, look at this. The Coveted Cat. Raymond, number 431. Oh my gosh, guys. Remember people like villager hunting for like days and days and days and spending like millions of bells and millions of Nook Mile tickets to actually get Raymond um, to come live on their island. Um, I don't know if you can you can see it, guys, but like Raymond has two, Raymond has odd eyes. He has a green and a brown eye. Yeah. So I could... I, guys, I could have Raymond on my island now if I wanted to. And eventually I can invite Raymond to my, uh, to the roost, which will be really cool. All right. And then the NPC, oh, number 407 is Celeste. Oh, that's fantastic. Sorry about that, guys. All right, I am back. So we are on to the next pack of cards. All right, let's see who our first villager is. Oh, guys. Number 440 is Quinn. Oh, I like Quinn a lot. I might actually consider actually bringing an eagle onto the island. I just, I love the purple. That's, that's just awesome. All right, next villager is Rio, number 444. Number 437 is Marlo, our little thug hamster. Ah, oh, guys, look. Number 427, I have Dom. 
Guys, I finally have Dom on my island. I shouldn't say I finally have Dom. I actually got Dom a while ago um, as a gift um, amiibo card. So, uh, but guys, yeah, I got Dom on my island. How very awesome. Awesome, awesome. And number 429 is Sid. Sid kind of looks like a tomato, doesn't he? And our NPC, oh guys, 422 is Wardell. Oh guys, that's awesome. Yes, indeed. All right, and guys, the last pack of the day. Who do we have, guys? Oh guys, we got a duplicate. Number 432 is Renee. Uh-oh, guys. Number 437 is Marlo, our thug hamster. Guys, what? Number 427 is Dom. Ah, oh, guys! Yes! Number 425 is Sherb. <laughs> that's awesome. <gasps> yes, guys, we have Megan. Oh, that's awesome. So 426 is Megan. Guys, did anybody ever have Megan on their island? I think she's so cute. I think she'd be fun to have as a bear villager on the island. Because she's, she's large. She's not a cub. She's definitely a bear. I don't know. I think she'd be really cool to have on the island. I'll have, to, I'll have to think about that. But she might be somebody that I would uh, actually use the campsite and invite over and, and replace possibly one of my villages that might have moved into the Woodland District area of my island. And our last NPC of the day, guys. Guys, Wardell again, 422. Oh, guys. All right, well... Out of that pack, definitely uh, Megan and Sherb. I mean, those were definitely the winners. And then, of course, I mean, yeah, seriously, Dom. Dom is incredible. I'm so excited to have him on the island. Yeah, guys, so this is really cool. All right, hang on. Let me get these situated, and we'll go over them again real quick. All right, guys. So to do a quick recap on my villagers and NPCs that I got today. And let's take a look at this. Guys, take a look at that reflective. There we go. So for my NPCs, I have Celeste. I have Wardell. I have Sherb. Megan, Dawn, Sid, Raymond, Renee, Ioni, Marlo, Quinn, Chabwick, Rio, and Fret. So guys, I got these in order so I can actually put them in my book. I actually do have a book that I picked up. Um, I was originally looking for like just a baseball card book and I could not find one. So I ended up going to like a, um, almost like a Dungeons and Dragons, Myths and Maiden type store um, that had the, um, like the, the, the games that you'd play um, with all the cards. And so I actually was able to pick up a book um, that can accommodate actually all of my amiibo cards. So and hopefully I'll be able to squeeze series 5 in um, as well. I might have to shift some of the cards around because I left some spaces um, not realizing that there was originally going to be a series 5 um, and yeah it should fit. It should fit. I'm just got to do a little organizing. But Alright guys, thanks a lot for taking a look at my video and taking a look at me opening up my amiibo cards. 
Um, I appreciate it. So, sorry I had to stop and, and pause the video a couple times. Um, I live in a condominium building and um, I'm in my kitchen that has a fire door and you can hear everybody um, leaving their condos and, and, and walking by my unit. And for some reason, everybody seems to need to be um, leaving their condo and having like a full-on conversation out in the hallway for several minutes um, and not even leaving the building. So, yeah, the joys, the joys of living in an apartment-style condominium. An older building, anyways. So, but guys, thanks for taking a look at the, um, at me opening my Amiibo cards today. If this is your first time watching my video, think about subscribing. I have um, another set of Amiibo cards that I'm going to be opening for Series Five as well. And um, yeah, we'll see who we get. All right, guys, thanks for tuning in today, and until next time, we will talk to you soon. Bye, guys.